Hello healers! Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today we're going to have another fun pick a card video. This one is all about what is next on your love life. So if you're single or if you have someone, doesn't matter, just think of the situation you have at the moment and think of what is next for you in the pick a card, all right? Like I always say, my details and the details of the cards that I use will always be in the description below. This is a general reading. If you want something very specific for your situation, you can always contact me. I do private readings, but I hope you have fun. This is going to be group number one, and this is two, and this is three, all right? So just concentrate on the card or on the crystal. Think about your love life at the moment and what is next for you. Again, have fun and thanks very much for watching. Group number one, if you chose this lovely crystal here, many crystals inside here, lovely, leave here to help us out. What is next on your love life? I give you your cards. You have the judgment card. You have the six of swords. You have the four of wands. And you have a couple of oracle cards here, which is the eagle. See from the higher perspective. And you have the great gathering. It's all coming together. Intuitive hits, soul tribe. All right. Group number one. I hope you can see everything there. Right. Straight away, I'm feeling that some of you already had or will have a wake up call. All right. With this judgment card here, time to make a, a decision to really think what it's serving you or not, whether you are in a relationship already or not, if you want to just change an attitude or some change the situation at the moment, there will be a wake-up call that will make you decide for good what you want in your life, in your love life at the moment. And I see some of you walking away from a situation. And um, it could be this relationship or... I mean, this person, you know exactly what's going on with you. But I see some of you just walking away to start something new. Maybe you're even traveling. You're going away completely from someone. And um, like going far, like I say, moving or traveling, staying away from a situation because of this wake-up call. Something happens that will make you finally make a decision and walking away. But for really good because the four of wands is here showing that this is actually the best thing you can do because you're going to have so much time to celebrate and time for your family, time for meeting new people, new beginnings, friendships as well. Not just love life, but from that new can come towards you. All right. So I see you walking away from a situation with a wake up call, like, I don't know, something very specific happening and then will just make you leave everything and finally make your decision. It's not going to be easy because you do have some hurt out of the situation and you're taking away, you know, the, the learning uh, that have gone, have been going through. But don't worry because it's, it's a good thing because you're actually learning so much and you're growing with the situation and you're moving towards a much, much happier time here with the Four of Wands showing you, you know, celebrating with family, friends and actually meeting someone new, to, like having a chance to meet new people and then from that having a chance to to move on with from, you know, for your life, love life and meeting new people and more love interest. All right, so with this ego here active, really showing you uh, to, to choose to see the situation from a higher perspective, like what is good for you. Again, together here going with the wake up call and the decision, how can you finally make a decision is when you look from a different, different perspective and um, deciding to walk away. So it's not... Uh, um, a bad decision because you will move towards a much happier time. You can see here the difference on the cards, how dark this is. It's just a situation. It's like a wake-up call, a move from the situation, and then moving towards a much, much happier time. So I see you here maybe meeting someone in um, 
in a gathering, maybe in a party, maybe if you're attending a wedding or a family reunion, anything to do with meet, meeting other people, like, um, uh, like I say, a celebration of some sort, but then having a chance to meet someone new here and really, really healing from this previous situation because you you can see from the, a higher perspective, seeing from a completely different position, like see the difference here from where you are right now and from where you can be and uh, really seeing a different perspective and make uh, feeling happy about your decision, about uh, walking away. So I see you, group number one, walking away from a situation, maybe a person, maybe a, a relationship, but moving towards a much, much happier time. And we do have here the greater gathering. It's all coming together. Intuitive hits, soul tribe. Again, showing you here this, like uh, meeting other people, soul tribe, having the chance to meet someone new through maybe a gathering, maybe a party, maybe something, like I say, family reunion. It's something like that. It's like a party. And then you're going to have a chance to meet someone new, meet meet many other new people, but uh, definitely a lot of interest coming after this while, you know, you see things in a much, much better way, in a different perspective, really completely different view. You will look be, look back and feel much better about this decision here that you needed to make. But it's, like I said, at the moment is the wake-up call and uh, maybe already had this wake-up call and you're already making this move, but some of you will still be on this position here, having the wake-up call and uh, moving away. But just remember, it's a good move. You will really move towards much, much happier times, um, you know, that will bring a different connection, a different uh, time and the meeting new people and having a chance to meet someone, a love interest, much nicer. You will look back and see this time now being so, so different. Like you will understand it's a learning process, it's a learning curve in your life, but you will see that from a higher perspective. You will see this from a different point of view and be really happy because we can be happy with the difficult times as well, just understanding that it was a growing point of our lives. But I see you looking back really happy and uh, happy with what you you have accomplished and who you have met. So I really see a lot of interest uh, coming, not straight away because you have to go through this path here, but you're moving towards a much happier time in your life. So group number one, be confident, you know, that with your decision, don't worry and uh, understand it's just a process, a time of your life. It's a path that you're going through. But it's, you, you're going to celebrate, you're going to be really happy where you end up going to. All right? So I hope it resonated with some of you. If it did, let me know. I would be really happy to hear from you. Again, thanks very much for watching. Group number one. Group number two, if you chose this beautiful orange crystal here, we leave it here to help us out. What is next on your love life? We have the Empress. We have the Knight of Wands. We have the Eight of Wands. Just making sure you have, you can see all of the cards. We have the Mother Earth, feel loved and comforted. And we have the Lemuria card, creating heaven on earth, it's happening. Okay, I hope you can see all the cards. Just making sure you have way to see all of them. All right, group number two. I see you here straight away. Very interesting. Your love life here, the next. For some of you, this is really a lovely time because you're going to feel really happy with yourself, with the... Uh, uh, the Empress here showing you feeling like uh, the Mother Earth here. These two are really connected. And like I always say, I don't choose the cards. I pray the higher powers choose them for you. These two here, it's really showing feeling loved and feeling really good about yourself. So if you're not there yet, if you're already in a relationship, you you can, for some of you, can really expect actually pregnancy 
and being really connected with the other person. You can see here she's pregnant and the Empress represents pregnancy as well, but really being connected with uh, how happy you are, feeling good about yourself, feeling good about the relationship. So if you don't have someone yet, someone is definitely coming here. Someone is coming, the Knight of Wands is really showing someone here with passion coming towards you pretty soon, really, really fast here coming towards you, showing everything they want. They want to be with you, passion coming really, really fast here. And if you're single, it may not be just one person. It may be more than one. You will have choices, all right? Or if you have someone, it's really about uh, having that f good time on the relationship that you feel really happy about it, feel really grounded, feel really protected, and uh, feeling protected, uh, protecting about the relationship and the other person as well. And uh, for some of you, like like you're showing here, really loved and and comforted in the relationship. And for some of you, even pregnancy as well. Right? Not all of you, don't worry if that's not what you want. It's just about that feeling of being comforted, being loved. You will feel this really, really um, soon. If you are with someone, they will show everything, all their emotions to you, make you feel really good about this relationship. Or if you're single, someone is coming towards you really, really fast. And uh, like I say, may not be just one person. It, you're going to have choices here. All right? Interesting here, the way it's showing, but there's someone passionate about you and showing everything the way they want to be with you all right we do have the lemuria card here creating heaven on earth it's happening so it's really about showing you this is the time this is really a time that's happening for you and like i say it's happening here this feeling the the happy times in this relationship if you already have or the happy times coming towards you if you're single you're gonna have options you're gonna feel so good about yourself and uh, you coming someone is coming really interesting and showing that they really want to be with you and you're going to be feeling really loved and comforted and happy with yourself and you're gonna like i said for some of you have options here to choose but just remember it's happening really fast so it's about make sure making sure you choose someone that has everything to do with your own ideas and passions as well so it's showing all the ones here. So make sure you are going to be true to yourself and honest with this person to show what you want and just be with the one you actually want to be and don't compromise here because you're going to have options, some of you. All right, so just make sure you choose the one that really goes together with you, your ideas, your passions. Don't compromise on just choosing the first person that comes towards you because you have been single for a while or something like that, don't worry about that. Just choose someone that it has everything to do with you so you can really have this good feeling here of uh, being in a love relationship that is bringing you everything that you want and everything that you have been asking for. All right, so group number two, this is really, really good here, really beautiful. Like I say, for some of you, it's actually pregnancy coming towards this relationship is a new phase of the relationship, uh, but don't worry if that's not what you want. It's just for some of you, I see that. So I hope it does resonate with some of you who are hoping to get pregnant or maybe you are already and you're going to feel really good about that. But if you are not, don't worry. It's really just a time of passion and, and comfort and feeling loved about yourself. Whether you are with someone or if you are not, someone coming towards you showing everything that you want to and you can make sure to that to feel that way because the love and comforted here the the empress as well showing that you're gonna be really really happy with the situation and it's really soon it's really really quick with the fast eight of wands here showing how fast this is gonna move towards you all right so i hope you're happy with that and i hope you resonated in some way because it's coming really really soon Okay, group number two. If it does resonate, let me know. There's a beautiful card here for you. It's a lovely, lovely time coming towards you. So make sure you enjoy and be true to yourself and make sure you're not compromising and uh, show what you want because someone is coming towards you, bringing everything that you want or this relationship is moving towards a different uh, time and a, a different path, a different phase of the relationship that you're going to feel really comfortable and really really comforted and loved and uh, really being there for each other 
all right so if it does resonate let me know i'll be really happy to hear from you but if you made it so far thanks very much group number two group number three if you chose this beautiful crystals here we leave it here to help us out what is next on your love life we have the hermit we have the eight of pentacles we have the wheel of fortune and we have the oracle here wait for important information and we also have the protection call back your power cut the cords soul retrieval all right group number three interesting time here on your for your life and showing here with the hermit that maybe it's time to to walk away a little bit and have some time for yourself not walk away from relationship or anything like that if you're already with someone but just have some time for yourself meditation time to to learn a little bit more about yourself and work on this situation whether you want to be with someone work on the relationship some hard times here to really put some work on it and the communication uh, showing what you want sh you know goals that kind of thing and uh, you, you you will be able to manifest anything you want right so if you are single at the moment just take time for yourself to understand what you really want on someone what you're looking for what you have been doing so far that didn't help you maybe there is some kind of patterns that need to be changed for you to actually manifest that person that you want and the wheel of fortune here is showing that you you will be able to to bring you know the, the, the ups and downs in, on your life and but it's time to move that wheel it's time to bring things that you want towards yourself there is some hard work to be done some of you on yourself on your own self like learning about yourself or what you want and some of you on the relationship itself if you're already with someone like i say communication goals uh, make sure you 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 show them what you want and you know have long conversations and um you know, being able to express yourself and uh, learn about each other and communication is really important coming to to me here. So you can turn the wheel if you if it's not if it, it didn't do so well so far the relationship or you you got to a point where things are not really doing so well. Don't worry, you can turn that around. But the oracle here is saying wait for information for important information. So make sure you wait to get more information whether it's so you need the more information that's why i'm saying you need the time to communicate to sit down and talk with this person if you already have someone or if you don't have someone wait for more information about this person that maybe you are um, looking or you are interested on and uh, before making a decision you will be able to turn things around you but you will need more information you need to work towards this person to turn them around to to your side if you're single if you are with someone it's time to understand what you want communication work on the relationship you need it's really time to work on this uh, love relationship and you will be able to turn things around okay it, it is a good um, future here for you guys but you need more information you need more about it to know more about each other or you need to know more about yourself if you're single right we do have here the protection card call uh, call back your power cut the cords soul retrieval so again here the soul retrieval connecting with the hermit um, there's some some cords to be cut here if you're single maybe you have to cut some cords with your past relationships or maybe you know dependency so much on someone or maybe even a family to be able to move on towards this next uh, phase of your life to be able to bring someone to your life so i feel like uh, if you're single maybe you're holding on a little bit too much to your past and uh, maybe it's time really to take some time for yourself and understand what you want work on yourself work on bringing this um, new phase into your life and you will turn the wheel around really will turn towards yourself and what you want and someone can come towards you i feel like someone is coming if you're single coming towards you but not straight away because you need some work to be done 
right? And like I say, you need to cut some cords with the past, maybe an ex, maybe even some family dependencies. Be more independent, be more about what you want, what you want to do for yourself. And then you will attract this this new phase in your life and, and, and a new person, someone interesting coming towards you. But you need more information about yourself. You need to work on yourself. And if you're already with someone or if you have, a, um, you know, a relationship, someone that you're already working on to or interested, really interested on, you need more information. You need, you need more communication. You need to be able to work together for these two, for this relationship to work. There's some hard work to be done, but there is a progress as well. There is um, a, a, like a, a way for you to turn the wheel around towards what you want. If you want to really work on this relationship and be with this person, more communication, like I say, setting goals together, sitting down and understanding each other, listening as well. It's not just about talking, it's about listening. See what the other one wants. And you will be able to work to turn the wheels around and do what you want uh, and, you know, having a different path, uh, more happier times on this relationship. All right. So I feel like there's some work to be done, whether you're single or not, but you will be able to, first of all, discover what you want for yourself in this relationship or on your path and be able to work together to grow and turn the wheels around towards yourself. So you will have, if you're single, someone come into your life, but after this work is, is done, all right, you need some work to be done first. And if you already have this person, you need to work in this relationship for the wheels to turn, for things to work more towards what you want. So it, it is, there is a way, okay? You, you will be able to do this, but it needs to be together. So you need more information, more communication, and uh, things will turn around in your favor, okay? So don't worry, it will turn around in your favor no matter what. It's just a time a little bit for soul retrieval. So understanding what you want and going for what you want, being able to communicate in a loving way. Okay, so if it did resonate, let me know. I'll be really happy to hear from you. I hope it did. I hope it helped you somehow. And um, like I always say, it's general. If you want something very specific, do contact me. I'm going to be really happy to hear from you. But if it did resonate, leave me a message. Subscribe if you're not a subscriber already. I'm really happy to have you here in the channel and there are many other videos coming your way okay again thanks very much for watching group number three